Thank you. Good job. We got a pretty exciting week ahead of us taking the SGR to Mombasa. So this trip is kind of a collaboration with a content creator I've been following for about a year and a half now. His name is Swale. I met Swale a couple days ago and we kind of planned this trip. So now today's the day we're finally going. I spent like the past like week in Nairobi. It's been cool, but I feel like there's not really much to do out here. So I'm very excited to see what, we're, what we got. Um, we got Mombasa and then after that we got a couple of different locations. But y'all gonna have to wait and see where we're going. How you feel? Wow. Well, it feels great, bro. Finally leaving Nairobi. I feel like I've been trapped here. There's not really much to do. I mean, it's a city at the end of the day. Can't really do much besides go out to the club, go to the city, go to the restaurants, cafes. So finally feels nice to go back to the beach and get the island vibes. All right, so we made it on the train. Kind of a little bit close. It is 2 for day and the train leaves at 3. So we got kind of a little close. Let's go, bro. Oh, my man, Swale, you got first. So we're going to be on here for six hours. So I'll see you in the bus. Yeah. Somebody yeah. told me there was lady boys in Mombasa. I'm not, I don't know why I'm smiling while I'm saying that, but that's not my type, you feel me? <laughs> I, like, I like women, but someone told me you could find the lady boys here. Now, now I'm being told that's not possible. Okay, so we just got to Mombasa, now we're waiting for a ride. Oh, he's, 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 he's here. So about to get on a ride and hopefully get some food, because again, I am starving. Where are we at right now? Asking over back here. This is the best restaurant I can recommend in this city. Well, I said this one is his favorite spots in Mombasa, so we're gonna see how it is. It smells pretty fire. It's true. Trust me. All right, so food just came. I'm not gonna lie, I almost forgot to record, but I got the chicken leg and then the butter naan. Great flavors. Great flavors. Definitely different flavors from Nairobi. This is, I feel like this is more authentic Swahili food, so I'm enjoying it for sure. Good morning y'all, so today is the start of the first official day in Mombasa. Right now I'm on the balcony of our Airbnb and this is what it's looking like. So we got a pretty long day ahead of us. We're gonna check out of here in I believe like 15 or 30 minutes. I think the first move is to head to Old Town. I don't know what the plan is out there, but we're gonna explore a little bit. Swale has a bunch of stuff planned, but I'm kind of just going with the flow, so we're gonna see what we get into. What's up, bro? What's your name? I'm Africa Goys, and this is our work. I'm mm -hmm. glad on it. So you're a Matatu driver? Yeah, I'm a Matatu conductor, the finest conductor in Bamburi, Mtambo 001, Bamburi. How long have you been a conductor? Yeah, I've been for 10 years, for now. What motivates you to start this profession? My motivation is that lately when I wake up in the morning, then I take the, the vehicle at the garage, then I Coming the passenger, that is right. So how, how many hours a day do you drive? Uh, about seven hours. Seven hours? Yeah, seven hours. But we are friendly with the passenger. Yeah, I'm very famous because the most thing in Bamburi Mtambo is only 10 shillings. The bagena, I went the bagena for 10 shillings, but I consider it all. Yeah, but it's good. The work is good. Yeah, and we love it. Yeah. He has been famous for many years. Yeah. You've been famous? Yeah, for many years. Famous on TikTok? And yeah, TikTok, YouTube. Yeah, I'm Africa Goyz, if you follow me. What made you famous? <laughs> the passenger, the passenger yeah. for living with the people. Peace, happy with the people. The people who are bargaining, you're taking them because see the lifestyle that you are living now. Yeah, you it's understand each other. If you, have, if you have today, it's okay. If you don't have, just going because it's our work. Some days you give people free rides, some days they pay. Yeah, some, some days they pay, sometimes they are down, but we are glad on it. Yeah, the work is good, we are thankful. They are so, both, so but this is the, the favorite today. work I have in my life. So why is this one your favorite? It's bring food on the table uh, okay. during the day, so that I'm glad on it. What's your favorite part of being a Matatsu driver? Uh, it is good because you're communicating, driving well, people are enjoying my work. Yeah, it is good. So, what inspired the artwork? 
The artwork. Yeah. Ah, the artwork. You know, we celebrate the, the celebrities you have seen here, yeah. the cones you are here. Yeah. yeah. If you see the other day of Mantamano, we were the, the only car in town. People were feared, but here we have the Gen Z. Gen Z. Yeah, the Gen Z were taking over at that, at that, that time. Yeah. Okay. Very cool, very cool. Do you feel like you have any competition with other drivers? Yeah, we have competition because people are famous here in Bamburi. Yeah, so if you have your passenger, then you go to town, you take a leave. But you don't have a passenger, there's a competition. If you see here, there's Badman, Zafdon, there's a competition. Because they're heavy, heavy vehicle. So what, what makes you unique? The thing that makes me unique is that I love my work. Yeah, and I do, I love my effort. Yeah. Cool. Is there anything else you want to say to anybody out there? Yeah, at the same time, we are doing music and this artwork, it pays a lot. I encourage the youth that this one brings the food on the table. You don't have to go to the office. This is the office that I depend on it. Yeah, and you are glad on it. Yeah, if you want to follow me, follow Mofrika Goys, TikTok, YouTube, Mofrika Goys, 001 Bamburi, the finest conductor in Bamburi. Yeah. Thank you, bro. I'm not even sure how well you can hear me right now, but as you can see, the Mitatsu coach is very lively. People are out here having fun, enjoying their time, enjoying, loving what they do. I've never seen some type of, uh, type of activity from African, so it's definitely a unique experience. This is Mombasa Bamburi. Yes, sir. Mom Bamburi in Kenya. And this is a town, small town. We thank God. We're going to pray with the Juma prayers. May God bless you. Have a safe trip. What's up, bro? What's your name? Bro, my name is Said, bro. Said, nice to meet you, bro. What's up? I'm Josh. What's your name, bro? Josh. Josh. Chris. 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 Hey, bro. Yes, yes. Finally. Finally made it to the old town. As you see right behind me is the Indian Ocean. And then we also got uh, Fort Jesus right there. If you don't know, Fort Jesus is one of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites. And it's, uh, it was a fort that was built in the 1500s, I believe. This is the official cameraman right here. You really putting in work though? <laughs> <laughs> See, I got caught, bro. No, you trying to play it off? Take you in the photo. Video. Video. Yeah. I take you in the video. Alright. Look, at this one, the camera. It's smart. Very smart. Come. Come, come, come. What if you just talk that <laughs> down in the water, bro? Shit. Sure. <laughs> you be putting a lot of faith in this man right now, bro. Hey, he knows what he's this doing. This one is sick. The nyali there. I see what he cooks up. I do someone tell you something. Okay. You want to tell him something? Yeah, I. What, what you want to say? What you got? What you got to say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You come with me. You <laughs> take me the photo like this. Look, 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 look. Ah, kafaranga ni. Y'all know what he's saying? You know what he's saying? <laughs> what did you just say? <laughs> You want no. to say something? Okay. Uh, no, uh, 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 yeah. Silence. Wimbo. Yeah, you wanna sing? Yeah. Uh, sing for us, bro. Sing for us, bro. Ayaribu mola kiri yautaki. Fungo furu. Ayaribu mola kiri yautaki. Subira, laila, eno mi, eno mi. No go pa mu, imar. Utaru jutani peni. Yeah. Very nice, bro. Hidden talent. Keep it hidden. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah, <No. you're> <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Your baby? Hmm? Your baby is taking me. Nah, nah, I don't have a baby. <laughs> you want him to be your father? Yeah. Oh, no, that's I'm crazy. Bro. Teaching the teacher, teaching me. You want to go to school? Yeah. That's a good thing, bro. I want to big, big one. Yeah. I want to teach me. My mama, my, my sister, my brother, my auntie, my uncle, my nyanya, dead. All of them? Yeah. Damn, yeah, bro. Please help me. So what do you eat typically? Chapati gumi. Chapati gumi every day. Yeah. That's so amazing. Send chapatis, bro. <laughs> nah, bro. So you're being good, bro. Yeah. Hey, you're being good, but you got some, some muscles low-key, bro. Yeah. yeah. Acting like he's starving, bro. Okay, okay, I see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go. 
Go slow, bro. Oh, yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Good job, bro. 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 Good In Old Town, a lot of people making like handmade crafts, selling like you know handmade goods, which is really cool. Welcome to Old Town, bro. Yeah, this is the first hotel they did. This, this is ho the first hotel in Kenya, bro. We've been walking around Old Town for a while, and it really feels like you're stepping into a whole different world, bro. Like just walking through the alleys and the streets, you can kind of get like a like a feel of the blend of cultures. Yeah, Zia's bro. <laughs> <laughs> Can't do nothing right here. <laughs> so far, Mombasa's is going crazy, bro. We're getting crazy shots. We got the shots of the kids running. We got the chefs of the kids playing soccer, man. It's going crazy out here, man. Tune in the jam, man. Tune in. So here we are on set. I'm trying not to be too loud because I want to disturb them. I'm sure you guys are what it's looking like. It's classified information with the shoe right now, so I'm not going to tell you, but it's pretty cool. We got some people coming from long ways to, to put this all together. I haven't been on a set like this in too long, bro. Too long, so it feels good to be back. We are here in Mombasa. Welcome. Karibu, it's been fun. And today we didn't know about meeting in Mombasa. We met in Kibera. Now things are different. Now we are twerk. You see, different vibes, different vibration. Karibu. Different, different runnings, different runnings. Different Talking soon, man. So, see you. I didn't really ask for a coconut, but I walked up and these kind of served us 50 shillings for a coconut. Pretty good. So as you can see right behind me, they're making the, the chips straight from the fresh cassava. I've never seen anybody do it like that. They're very good though. They taste like potato chips, but they taste like a little bit more thicker and it's like, I guess more of like a, like a plantain flavor. Hope y'all enjoy exploring Mombasa with me today. There's so much more to do out here, I feel like I didn't get to do all of it, so hopefully we can come back in a couple days and you know tour a little bit more. As always, thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna be traveling around Kenya for a minute, so I'm gonna be dropping so much, so much fire content, so make sure you see it.